Welcome in the kitchen with Sherry Angel. Today I have a recipe I want to share with you guys. These are all the condiments I'm going to use, all the meat and everything. So I have my sausage, I cut it already. I have some veggies and I have cabbage. Um, I cut my cabbage already. This is a meat I bought yesterday. I wanted to do another recipe but I just changed my mind. I cut it too and I have shrimps. Uh, this is ginger and this is a paper red orange I cut half of onion and three tomato and three goods of garlic so if it's your first time I'm gonna invite you guys to subscribe give us a thumbs up and let's go let's start so I put my oil, my oil is hot. I'm gonna start frying my sausage first. Careful, it's hot. So I start with the sausage because the sausage is not cooked. Uh, I wanna fry it first and after I'm gonna add other meat. So let's turn the sausage, give it a time to be a little bit red. This recipe is so rich, you're going to have everything, veggies and meat inside the rice so you don't need to add anything else, but it depends on you if you want to add anything, you can add anything on the side, but this recipe is really full, you have all the things you need for a full meal. So I'm going to add the shrimp. I'm gonna put a black pepper and then we're gonna let it fry after a few minutes I feel like my shrimp a little bit fried not all the way I'm gonna add the meat remember those that meat I told you I bought it yesterday so it's already cooked. I just want to give it a little bit of red to just warm it up a little bit because I don't want my meat to be too hard. So after a few minutes, you're gonna see the sausage are cooked. Look at the shrimp. The shrimp changed the color too. So for me, this is enough. This is ready. This is done. So we're gonna go to the next step subscribe guys give us a thumbs up and thank you for watching continue to watch the next step i'm gonna just grab that oil we use uh, for frying all the meat so i'm gonna add my oil i'm gonna put the green condiment guys like always i usually use i always use those green condiment i have whole video before those crunchy men guys if you want it go to my channel and check it out um this is the i'm gonna add the tomato uh, this is the ginger a spoon of teaspoon of ginger you're gonna mix the teaspoon of ginger That's garlic, add garlic, and then remember those tomato, fresh tomato I show you guys, I blend it, and now I put the blend fresh tomato. I'm gonna add my tomato paste, the whole can, I'm gonna put the whole can. We're gonna mix it and we're gonna try to let the tomato cook, uh, be cooked a little bit. So I'm gonna add the bouillon, like chicken bouillon, the adobo. It's like just a cube, cube like magi or chicken bouillon. So I'm gonna add, add that. I won't put too much salt. That's all I'm gonna put. But if you wanna add salt, you can add salt. But remember, our sausages are salted already. 
So we're gonna leave it for a few minutes and then we come back, look at the oils on the top of it, the sauce we just made. So we don't want that sauce to be burned down. Now we're gonna add our rice. Ladies, it's gonna make your kitchen messy, but after we're just gonna clean it up. So that's okay. So for me, I just add one and a half cup of rice. Uh, one and one and a half because I don't want the rice to be too much I don't want like I want it to be perfect so I'm gonna add my cabbage we're gonna mix all the veggies in like I told you this meal you're gonna have everything you have veggies you have meat you have rice so it's a complete 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 like recipe is a complete um what can i say dish yeah it's a complete dish <laughs> it's a complete dish so i add all my peppers onion everything i could mix it i could blend it but i don't want it to be bland so that's okay if you want it to be bland you can blend all the con all the, the 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 veggies you have like onion and everything but for me i just want it to be like that so that's perfect for me now we're gonna add our meat we're gonna turn 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 first a little bit but after we're gonna add our meat so our meat is here we're gonna mix our meat just take your time to fry a little bit the rice so i know it's a little bit hard when you have tomato but try to fry a little bit your rice so now i'm mixing my meat and everything so everything is inside it's so rich on everything on like everything is inside everything is ready so now we're gonna turn again Take your time to turn a little bit turn look at the rice you need to fry the rice with the oil and everything so we're gonna take our time to fry our rice a little bit and then we're gonna go put some water so for many people i don't know how you cook your rice but for many people when you add one cup of rice is equal uh, two cup of water but for me i usually put like one cup of rice equals one and a half cup of water so after putting everything we're gonna close the rice and come back later after a few minutes we came back to check and see is the water is almost done the rice is almost cooked but it's not really cooked yet so we're gonna put it in low heat look at my my stove is at four i cook it at four but after putting a plastic on the top we're gonna put it at very low heat for 25 minutes just let it be let it be let it see like i put in one now and then after 25 minutes i came back to open my rice everything is ready the rice is really cooked it's cooked nicely is not like on the cook is not like watering no everything is so perfect so my rice is cooked we're gonna mix and look under and everything if it's not ready yet guys take your time just put back the plastic and give it a few minutes again but my rice is cooked and look i put it at one you can put it at low or one it depends on how your stove is but yes my rice is cooked so we are ready to eat almost time to eat i just want to give you a close look of my rice i really want to give you a close look of my rice the color for me is perfect and the rice is cooked all the veggies are here so you can put a little bit of spice if you want it to be so spicy you can put spice inside or on the top when you put it on your plate guys like i told you 
look at it look at, like i told you guys i have kids so i don't cook really with spice but i put it on my plate all the time look how the rice is cooked look the shrimp and the sausage and the rice everything is calling me mm, bon appetit guys bon appetit so look how my rice is cooked you see it's really cooked it's not like non-cooked or when it's not cooked you can see it's white and everything but my rice is cooked it's really nice so yeah bon appetit thank you for watching guys don't forget to subscribe subscribe share you may share that to somebody who wants to try it don't be selfish share 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 tell everybody tell them so I'm going to see you next time to the next episode. Thank you for watching. Be blessed. Bye-bye.